Hi, Moglets. Today we're doing a pretty interesting challenge. I guess I'm just gonna call this the Pokemon challenge. Every now and then I ask the community for challenge ideas and uh, the top liked one I'm going to do. So this one is courtesy of Iago Muniz, only dealing damage with summons. Baron Bunny, Oz, Shanling's Bear, just like a Pokemon fight. One of the problems is I think those three examples are basically the only characters that kind of fit the criteria. We're going to take a quick look at the rest of the roster and see if we can throw anyone else in there. Before that though, I want to give a big thanks to today's video sponsor, Ragnarok Origin. Ragnarok Origins is a cute yet huge mobile MMORPG featuring tons of content and things to do. Starting with character customization, there are essentially infinite possibilities with the various weapons, armor, magic abilities, outfits, and more to change not only their look but how they play as well. Their fantasy open world design lets you discover mysterious, fun, and evil secrets that are hidden around the world of Ragnarok. You're free to choose your own path of different missions, events, and daily quests. You can collect and grow a wide variety of pets that'll help you on your journey. One thing I really appreciate about MMOs is when they have a mercenary system for solo players like myself, where you can essentially hire a team when you need more people. Of course, they also have a ton of team-based stuff as well, like real-time co-op content, unique raids and challenges, stories, guilds, and guild content such as Guild Feast and Guild Match. The graphics, visuals, and sound design are really well done too. But yeah, as usual, if this sounds interesting to you, I'll have a link to pre-register for Ragnarok Origins, so make sure to check that out. There's a lot of things I, I wonder if it counts, like, for example, Hu Tao's Spirit Soother. I mean, it says here she commands a blazing spirit to attack. This is something. You know, you can kind of consider it like an electrode that just goes out and self-destructs. If we can't fill the fourth spot for our team, then I will have to consider this, um, but we're going to continue on. Also, Deluxe Phoenix is kind of like a Moltres. Moltres? Illusory Phantom of Fate? I don't know, they're not like really animals, though. You know? Jumpty Dumpty, kinda. It's kind of more of an inanimate object, though. Though it does say here, Jumpty Dumpty is Klee's good friend. Oh yeah, of course, Sayu's ult. Yeah, I think Sayu's is definitely legit. The others, maybe not really, but Sayu's for sure. Obviously, Guoba from Shanling. Oh yeah, what about Sucrose's Wind Spirit? That's like a little fly there. It's definitely something. They, they also have like, you know, fairy types Pokemon in the meantime. Well, I think we're gonna start with the three that they uh, gave examples for, which is Fischl, Amber, and her. And we have to throw a fourth one in there, and I think Sayu fits the bill probably the closest. And of course, the challenge is I can only use the summons, so I can't basic attack with any of them or uh, do anything else, really. Oh wait, but that means at least for Sayu, once I do her ult, I can't use her anymore. <laughs> I mean, I guess she can get orbs from someone else. Well, we have our daily quest to do. I think we're going to start with that. I highly doubt I can do a single abyss stage like this, but we'll try just for fun later. I think this is just a talking quest, unfortunately. Yup, not super lucky today. This is also not a fighting quest. Maybe the next one. Okay, this is definitely a fighting quest and I'm already overwhelmed. What the heck do I do? <laughs> okay, uh, let's go ahead and start with Guoba. Go Guoba. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that for every time. Uh, go Oz. Okay, uh, official is dead. I don't think any of them have any damage on them. Go Baron Bunny, hurry up though. And Sayu, go ahead and get him out quickly. It's so annoying, I can't do anything else. And now everyone's outside of the range where she can do any damage. Uh, we're probably gonna have to mostly rely on Guoba. Oh my god, this is going to take forever. How am I even gonna get those guys up there? Oh, all I have to do is destroy the hill trail towers. Okay, let's go for that. Thank god. That shouldn't take too long, I just have to survive. Oh no. Even that's going to be hard. Oh my god, this is insane. Go, go, but oh my god, Shanling's dead. Maybe I should have at least, like, I don't know, geared them up as best as I could. Dude, this is insane. Look at all those enemies. How am I supposed to do anything? Oh god, well, I'm dead. Nope, just run away, just run away. I can't deal with this. One of the easiest daily quests in all of Genshin. Just teleport somewhere else. I gotta go heal. Well, obviously, they shouldn't be missing anything. And uh, we're gonna try and... Yeah, let's give Shanling Homa. Never thought I would do that, to be honest. Since we can only use Guoba, I want to make sure we have Pyro damage bonus. Actually, I think if we just go Hu Tao set, that would be good. Because Hu Tao also has a lot of HP. Shanling is going to kind of have to carry here. 
For Sayu, I'm just going to give her Greatsword back. She can only use her ult anyway, so won't get to see much use. Fischl, of course, we're going to gear her up a little bit. Probably only using stuff that no one else has equipped on right now because I don't want to keep swapping everything back and forth. Plus, she's only level 40, so Oz is not going to do that much regardless. We will give her an Electro Damage bonus, though. We have one free anyway. Oh, wow, she has four-piece emblem of Severed Fate. I'm going to count her ult as uh, being a summon as well because it does summon Oz if he's not already there. Literally says in her description, summons Oz. I haven't touched her talents. Amber's kind of the same story, honestly. I don't think I'd be able to get much out of her, even if I were to build her well. Maybe if we're a little bit more strategic and, kind, and can kind of, you know, sneak up on them before they notice me. Oh, God. The pyro slimes. I can't do anything to them either. Wow. I mean, Fischl just did 5k. Maybe I should build her. Well, I mean, I gave her the, uh, I gave her artifacts at least. Fischl can do something. Huh. Dang. <laughs> I'm surprised. We just got to go over here. Quietly, quietly. Shh. Go, Guoba. Okay. Ah, uh, just one more hit. Go, Guoba. Very pog. Where's the other one? The other one, I'm not sure if we'll be able to get stay out of their sight. Nope. They all noticed. Oh, God. We're screwed. They're all cut. Oh, Jesus. The bad thing is Guoba is going to always try and attack the enemies before the, the thing as well, if they're any close by. Oh. Can Guoba- Oh, ooh! Guoba did it! Done! Let's get out of here. I'm just trying to complete my daily quest. I think I recognize the location of this one, and I, and I believe I do have to actually kill some enemies here. Yep. Oh, gee. Oh, it's a timed one as well. We're- we're so dead. It's a timed one. What? I have four minutes. Oh, no. Okay, I just put up Oz, and- Oh, he's not doing anything. Go closer. Oh, and it's the shield dudes. We're so dead. We can't do this. Go. Oh, official is down. Go, Guoba. Actually can't do anything. Now the other dude has a shield. Oh, no. Yeah, that's not good at all. I'm going to have to build them all, and I'm going to have to make some exceptions. Okay. Oh, my lord. Okay, well, there are maybe a couple things I can change. Like, Fischl, I'm surprised. We can just give her, like, one of the better bows. I don't know. Thundering Pulse, sure. It suits her really nicely. There's nothing Amber can do at level 21. Do we waste XP books? Because I know at 40, they can do something, at least. 28 heroes wit. Alright, fine. She is also C3. I said, I said at C6, I would actually ra raise her fully. Um, and I'm gonna stick to that promise, so whatever. She will be C6 at one point, so not really a waste anyway. Let's see what we can give her. Probably just stuff that's not on anyone else. We can only use her Baron Bunny, and she already has t a plus 20 pyro damage bonus, so that's good enough. And I guess Amber can hold on to my level 90 Skyward Harp as well. That should help a little bit. But yeah, that's as much as I can do. So I'm gonna try again. If it's if it's still impossible, then I'm gonna make some exceptions. Like I don't know, food at least. So we're gonna start with Baron Bunny to get their attention. We're gonna go ahead and summon Oz. We're gonna go ahead and actually that's not super fair in Pokemon either. You're not supposed to. Well, I guess there are like double and triple battles. Dude, that guy's actually getting shredded. Ah, uh, he almost got shredded, and that dude has his. Ooh, wait, wait. We have her summon as well. Go! I forgot its name. Baron Bunny back. Uh, let's wait for officials Oz to come back. Oh no! Still getting one shot. Let's go. Uh, let's go Guoba then. Actually, this seems like it might be possible. Oh wait, but they're getting healed. Oh wait, they're healing each other. That's so. That's so. That's so bad. That's so not fair. Well, we're gonna heal Fischl at least. Go, Baron Bunny. Facial is back. Let's go. Yeah, the agent. Ooh, the agent is in the water. No, wait. Ah. Go, Guoba. Let's grab this as well. Hey, it looks like it might work, actually. <laughs> Can get Oz again. And Baron Bunny. This is really, really tough. I have to be super careful. Ooh, they're in the water, though. I, I got so lucky with this being next to a lake. Oh, the agent's almost down. We have two minutes left. Agent. Oh, the agent is so close to being dead. I'm going to use her Q. Okay, she died. What the hell happened to the other dude? He had a ton of HP left. 
I have no idea what happened to him, but I'm not going to complain. We beat it. <laughs> I'm so surprised. So now that we're done with dailies, I'm not sure. We can try like a boss. Let's go grab our daily rewards first. We have mostly pyro damage, so it has to at least suit that a little bit. What a huge difference good artifacts and weapons make. Like, level plays a much smaller role than I thought. Obviously, like, you know, getting them up to at least 80 is always a good idea, or at the very least 70 because they get their last passive. And some characters' passives are really important. But also, it's not a huge investment for level 80. Level 90? Really, really, truly only for in-game, I would say. What the hell am I doing? I don't need anything at the crafting station. All right, what are we gonna do? Magu Kinky? No, 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 definitely not. Okay, we'll try. We're gonna get our asses kicked so bad. Hello there, scrub, are you ready to die? No, that mask shouldn't have hit me. Well, we'll try once more just for fun, I suppose. 69, 78, ow, I need to stop looking at the numbers. Does he get distracted by Baron Bunny? Not really, it looks like. Oh, that was close. I framed like a pro on accident. Unfortunately, Oz is now not doing anything. I so wish I could use Sean Ling's ult, but uh, I guess that's not really a summon. Oh no, oh, yeah, boy, you saw that? Okay, he's transforming. Oh, run. Oh, she's alive though. That was close. What are you doing? Too many. Too many attacks at once, calm down. Let's throw another Baron Bunny just to mix things up a little bit and probably we're dead. Move, move, move. What was that, 1100 Animo? Ooh, speaking of which, who cares? Her thing is ready. Let's mix some Guoba in there. Maybe even some fish. Oh no, oh God, no, I got it, no fish. I don't know how I avoided that, pure luck. But all right, ooh, dude, he's half dead. We, we might actually be able to do this. Oh, dude, no, 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 oh, it was gonna be so cool. All right, Guoba, uh, Fischl. We're gonna use her burst. It literally is summoning Oz, and unfortunately that cost us our life. Forget it, let's use our revive on Fischl. Oh no, that was bad, move. No, Sean Ling, I definitely need you. Okay, let's throw that up there. Wait, 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 what's going on, Sayu? You're sacrificed because you don't have your ult yet. I guess that's gonna explode. What is that swirl? Amber is doing some weird swirl stuff, but it might just be coincidence. Okay, it didn't do it that time. Whatever, like after he does the sword slashes, cause that's the stuff I can't avoid. Yep, here we go. Okay, I, yeah, we're, we're, we're getting the hang of it. Let's go ahead and throw those two down again. Oh no, we gotta go back to Fischl and, wait, what? Dude, stop, that's so, he just keeps teleporting everywhere. This is so unfair. Sayu, Sayu, so close. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I actually was not coming here expecting to kill Magu Kinky like this, <laughs> but we did it. Okay, one more challenge, I suppose, before we wrap it up. I did say we would try Abyss. Can we at least swap out Amber? No, we're only gonna try the first chamber though, cause like everyone's equipment is messed up now and I'm not sure who has what. Everyone does start with their ult, which is cool. Gotta save Sayus for uh, emergency. All right, what do we got, what do we got? Ooh, that's bad to start. Let's just go and start with Guoba and that. Let's go ahead and throw Amber's Baron Bunny down as well. Grab the chili pepper. All, all we can really do is run around <laughs> until we can summon our stuff again, so. Ooh, ouch. Uh, I guess we gotta go out there and kill these dudes. Dang, that did a lot though. Gotta kill this archer over here as well. Uh, I so want to do Shodling's ult. So annoying. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and do Sayu's ult. It's not super dangerous yet, but still. Let's go ahead and do Fischl's as well. Just trying to be careful here. Back to Goba. There goes the last slime. There are only five enemies left. Can't do anything with her right now. Baron Bunny. Damn, leave me alone. There you go. Oh, geez, we have a Hillichurl and a tiny ring now. Oh, no. We gotta go back to Shanling and get, get rid of this dude and then go back to the ring. Because the only way we can heal right now is through Sayu and she does not have her ult. So we just kind of have to not take damage from this stuff. We can throw Baron Bunny back. We'll need that. Oh, wait, no. No, 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 no. What are you doing? And he moved Guoba. No. Oh, but no, Guoba, focus on the... 
Goba. All right, gonna use her ult. Ooh, that almost did enough. Oz. Gotta move. Gotta move my bear. Oh, <laughs> there it was. Okay, I'm done. When I first read this challenge, I thought it'd be really fun, and it actually is kind of fun, but I just don't think there's a big enough selection of heroes where you can, like, seriously tackle some stuff. I mean, I'm not sure what the actual rules would, like, I'm gonna finally do Shanling's ult. That is kind of a summon, while, like, it stays there, you know, for a while, but it's kind of an inanimate object, it's just a spinning disc, which doesn't physically make any sense since, you know, unless it was not an inanimate object and that, you know, it, it could consciously circle her. Whatever. I'm done rambling. That was this challenge. Mago Kinky is kind of a hard boss, actually, so I'm satisfied we could we, we could beat him <laughs> like this. Uh, but yeah, you know, if you have any other challenges, you can throw them in the comments or you can just wait until I do another community post. There were a couple of other really high liked uh, challenges that I might do in the future as well, just because. Um, but yeah, for now, that'll do it. Again, drop any thoughts in the comments down below. Dropping a like on this video if you did, I'm doing enjoy is always greatly appreciated as well. Thanks, as always, for watching, and until next time.